I was surprised that very few YouTubers spoke about this awesome and really affordable tool to make your portraits shoots even cooler. So let's fix that in this video. Congratulations on taking the first step towards enhancing your portrait photography with canvas backdrops. Since I added canvas backdrop to my portrait accessories, I feel a lot more like Annie Libovitz. That's a lie. But what if I told you there's more to canvas's backdrop than she lets you on? Let's talk about how you can enhance your backdrops using one very simple tool. How can you do it? Well, just take a look around your house and let's get creative. Just like we build images in Photoshop or Capture One, canvases can help us add depth and texture to our portraits. By introducing layers, we make our visuals much more captivating. To help demonstrate this, I'd like to share some branding images I created for my friend Christine, who recently launched her wellness business and won some brand images that reflect, well, wellness actually. So for this portrait session, I use the canvas backdrop with colors that match her clothing. The canvas was painted by myself, so you can't find it online. And then I added layers to create depth and interest. To achieve this, I used the Julius Studio crossbar to set up my backdrop. You can either open your phone camera at this moment or see the link right below this video in the description and click the first link to learn more about the Julius bar. Now that you see it, you understand how it works. The Julius bar is a great as it helps you add up to five additional layers to pretty much anything. In my setup, I added very simply, inexpensive white sheer curtains to give it a free and more relaxed look. So instead of having a plain canvas or a plain backdrop, I made it more appealing by just adding or incorporating these curtains. But there's more to that. So imagine you want to add more and more layers or even more curtains. The genius of using that Julia Cross Studio Bar is that it can support up to five bars on the single light stand. So you can keep adding layers and layers and layers of fabric plants without being worried about overloading the bar since each layer has its own bar. The only maybe negative thing is that you have to add some extra bars or buy some, but they're quite affordable. So imagine the endless possibilities you might get from using a tool like the Julius Cross Bar. Is that an idea that you'd like to try out? Let me know if in comment that interests you or share this with a friend that's really, really passionate about backdrops. They'll surely appreciate it. This has been Evans B and I'll see you in the next video.